guys, it's Lena from the Land of Gods. Yes, I am back from the break. A rather long, long, long break. But I'm so, so, so happy that I'm back to you guys, to my cards and to my readings. This one is for the sign of Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Guys, as usual, please remember these are general readings. Times fluid and energies can be reversed. So take what resonates and leave the rest for others to receive. And one more shuffle, Scorpios. We should be ready. Gonna look into the challenge presented, advice, and the outcome if the advice is followed. We're gonna clarify all that and wrap up the reading with an energy oracle guidance message spirit patience oh somebody is being all in a hurry very restless being very impatient to do something to get somewhere i hear mm. let us see what's the advice the advice please Ooh, okay we have the messenger of water that's the knight of cups along with the four of earth that's the four of pentacles grounding is needed clearly this rush that we feel is fear of missing the train we do not need to miss something we should not we must not die here miss something in that rush that might add to further delay i hear and if we take the advice we are heading towards very stable grounds king of earth wow i hear with that comes responsibility as well but you will have the resources to take care of the responsibilities five of waters right there five of cups now here i feel that You've been asked to focus on letting go of this rush. Ace of waters there, ace of cups. Something new is definitely on the horizon, clearly. And we are in some sort of rush. Patience coming in the challenge. This card is all about taking it slow, taking your time, you know, going through the nitty gritties all of that standing in the challenge is that sense of rush let's get over with this whether it is paperwork whether it is any issue that needs to be sorted in a relationship you cannot rush people through things you cannot rush people through emotions because you are being restless so in that rush you are pushing others too i feel with messenger of waters and four of earth coming in as the advice it's like you are told to look into whatever this delay is from a positive point of view that everything happens for a good reason even if it is a delay there might be something that i am missing or i am being given a time to you know cool things off it's basically looking at whatever the situation that you find yourself in through a positive lens that whatever is happening is happening for a reason and the reason probably is for you to give yourself the time to calm your nerves down and deal with whatever this is whether it is a situation personally I feel more personal than professional, but whatever this is, you need to find your grounding. And if you do that, it looks like from this impatient phase, you're going to come into a place where you would understand why this delay happened and it happened for a reason. It happened for something good. And that realization is coming in. And along with that comes that sense of stability and calm from being so restless to being calm yeah that's what's happening here let us clarify people patience standing in the challenge spirit six of wands yeah you want to get 
there you want to just be do you know get done with the process doesn't work like that loves we have to go through the process and whatever time it's going to take it's going to take simple as that we have temperance lovers yeah we are rushing someone into something i think we are being quite pushy in getting things done you know getting to a certain level temperance is also there it seems like we are kind of losing our balance also we're not really able to look at this situation from a wider from a long shot we just want it done and we want it done now whatever the, whatever the result may be that's the rush that i feel that i don't care whatever it is just let's get done with it yeah with death and empress and nine of cups ten of pentacles this is all about i want it and i want it now yep there is no patience there is no way that we want to you know look at things from a different angle or take things slow with that knight of pentacles and four of cups now we have become very tunnel visioned in this we are not giving anybody time neither are we giving ourselves any time to process this and you are told this is exactly when you need to take a step back when you feel rushed or you are rushing yourself and along with that others that is where things go wrong that is where you miss those details that is where you land up pushing people away from you because you're so desperate to get things done to start something to end something start something this could be a rebound for someone i hear or this could be a reconciliation and you are not giving the other person their time to you know deal with their emotions it's like i said sorry what more do you want from me there is a sense of i don't want it to end i'm going to do whatever you want me to do but let's just fix things you know i just said sorry so everything needs to come back to normal when has that worked ever that it's going to work this time seriously scorpios let's see messenger of cups along with the four of earth you need to give people the time for them to process and you should take that time to process as well high priestess coming in so that you get the chance to look at it through that wider lens that i'm talking about the king of wands yeah now king of wands is all about mastering something you know being really really good at doing something that you do and to get to that level where in you land up inspiring others it takes time and it takes a lot of hard work and it takes a lot of patience and it takes a lot of processing and you are told high priestess coming along with the king of wands i feel it is not only getting good or the best at what you are doing but also doing it in a way that connects you your 3d self to your internal self to your higher self i feel in this rush we are forgetting the whole purpose of being with someone or doing something we are just doing it for the heck of doing it because you want to succeed in it so desperately that we are losing touch with our own self and we need to get back in touch with our self with our grounding we are losing the grounding yes and we are told give yourself and everybody else involved in this whatever this is the time so that all parties involved get the time to process this whether it's emotions whether it's documents whatever this process is and in the meantime you get better at what you are doing even if it is let's say a reconciliation that you have the right words said in the right tone at the right time and for you to do that you need to give yourself that time as well and if we do that king of earth 
king of pentacles this man knows how to take care of himself and everybody else this man is a man who knows how to take responsibility and see through things that they are done they get done he makes sure that they get done so you'll get wherever you want to be the rush is just going to delay the process that's it five of pentacles with the king of earth this is you realizing where you were lagging if you give yourself the time this is you realizing what you were not doing the right way this is you finally finding that leak in the boat so that you can fix it once you give yourself that chance to become really really good at what you are doing this is taking that time to give yourself that grounding and once you have that that's when you would be able to see where you were going wrong strength and it's not easy whatever this is that you're trying to process it's not easy and it takes a lot of strength to pull yourself back when your first instinct is like let's get it done you know let's get through it no -uh. it takes a lot of self control i hear to pull back and that's what you are told to do team that beast who is in a rush in a lot of rush no need to rush no need to rush all right scorpios let us get you a guidance message from the energy oracle deck there we are okay let's get it done Oh, look at that. That was fast. All tied up. It's that kind of knot that the more you pull, the tighter it gets. Yeah, it is like that. This card shows a woman tied up with vines around her wrists, body and arms. Receiving this card upright represents a situation in your life where things seem to be severely stuck. A major drama may be going on around you stopping you from moving forward or it may be that some technicalities are blocking your way perhaps you are waiting for a contract to be signed or an agreement to be made exactly that's what i feel that this is the reason why you are not able to process it smoothly because you feel stuck and when we feel that we feel like you know let's get over with Whatever is holding things up, the restrictions may be feeling quite oppressive at this time. If this isn't technically the case for you, what's tying you up is your own personal stuff. Look at your life and see how you can be your own jailer. Are you tying yourself up in some emotional angst or in a negative habit that you refuse to deal with? If so, it's time to cut the vines and make some serious changes now. You need not live in your self-imposed jail any longer. You would see where you are going wrong if you give yourself that time. And on that note, I'm going to take your leave. Thank you so very much for joining me this week. It's a wrap. Namaste from the land of gods.